I can't be the only one who has ever felt slightly confused about the impact that your image sensor has on the true focal length of your photo, right? As someone who has used an APS-C camera for years, I've always wondered what impact that has had on the final crop of my photo, but online, I would always find conflicting information. Some people would say that you only experience a crop when you're using a full frame lens on a non full frame camera. And then others would say that you experience a crop no matter what kind of lens you're using. So now I currently own a full frame camera and an APS-C camera. So I want to put this to the test and finally put this question to rest so I can sleep at night. I am making this video for my own good. <laughs> for this test, I have Mr. Full Frame, my Canon R5C, and Mr. Small But Mighty, my Canon M50, which has an APS-C sensor. By the way, if you're at all curious as to how this $500 camera compares to this $5,000 camera in other ways, then hit that subscribe button because I have a lot of videos coming up comparing the two, and my next one will be comparing photo quality. Anyways, let's get started. To start off, I'm gonna connect my Canon EF 50mm lens to both of these cameras using a basic Canon mount as opposed to a speed booster mount. The mounts that I'm using are linked down below in the description if you're at all curious as to what exactly they are. I'm setting up my tripod 10 feet away from the subject, aka me, to take turns with getting video and photos with each camera at the same distance. Rumor has it Mr. Small But Mighty should crop in a lot more than Mr. Full Frame since the EF 50mm lens is a full frame lens. And story checks out. Here is some video. And here are some photos, both of which show that the Canon M50 does in fact crop the photo of a full frame lens. So now it's time for the real test. What happens when I put an APS-C lens onto an APS-C camera and compare it to a lens at the same focal length on a full frame camera? Aren't you curious? I know I was. So for this test, I'm gonna put my RF 16 millimeter lens on my Canon R5C and my Sigma EF-M 16 millimeter lens on my Canon M50. Note, the RF 16 millimeter lens is a full frame lens on a full frame camera and the Sigma EF-M 16 millimeter lens is a APS-C lens on an APS-C camera. And here are the results. So I started this test standing five feet away and it looks to me like the Canon M50 still has a significant crop even though the lens I'm using is a lens built for an APS-C sensor. Interesting, right? Here's the same lens with me standing 10 feet away. And what a difference. By the way, I also did a similar test at 70 millimeters and 100 millimeters with some variable lenses, each built for the specific camera sensor, and the results were the same. So there you have it. You experience a crop with an APS-C sensor camera, even if you're using an APS-C lens. Kind of mind blowing, right? <laughs> if you found this video at all insightful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And until next time, bye.